There was once in the enchanting land of Glitterville, there lived a special unicorn named Stardust. Stardust had a coat that shimmered like a thousand diamonds, and her mane was a cascade of colors that sparkled in the sunlight. But what made Stardust truly unique was her magical ability to make the wishes come true. In Glitterville, there was a tradition where every year, all the magical creatures gathered to celebrate the Festival of Dreams. During this festival, each creature would make a wish, and Stardust, with her magical powers, would help make those wishes come true. It was a time of joy and wonder, and everyone in Glitterville looked forward to it. One year, as the Festival of Dreams approached, Stardust noticed a sadness in the eyes of a little pixie named Twinkle. Twinkle had always been the liveliest and happiest creature in Glitterville, but lately her spark had dimmed. Stardust decided she needed to find out what was troubling her friend. Twinkle, my dear friend, why do you seem so sad? Stardust asked, her voice as gentle as the breeze. Oh, Stardust, sighed Twinkle, I've lost my favorite silver wand, the one that makes the most delightful music when I wave it. I've looked everywhere, but I just can't find it. The Festival of Dreams is just around the corner, and I don't know if I can make a wish without it. Stardust nuzzled Twinkle with her soft nose. Don't worry, dear Twinkle. I will help you find your wand, and together we'll make the most magical wish at the festival. With a determined sparkle in her eyes, Stardust set out on a journey through the enchanted forest, where the trees whispered secrets and the flowers sang sweet melodies. She asked every creature she met if they had seen Twinkle's silver wand, but none of them had. As Stardust continued her quest, she encountered a wise old owl named Luna. Luna perched on a branch and blinked her large, knowing eyes at Stardust. Ah, uh, Stardust, I have heard of your noble quest to find Twinkle's silver wand. Luna hooted. I believe the mischievous moonlight mice might have taken it. They love shiny things, you see. With this new clue, Stardust followed Luna's advice and headed towards the moonlight mice's cozy burrows hidden among the tall grass. As she approached, she heard tiny giggles and the sound of twinkling music. There, in the middle of a moonlit clearing, the moonlight mice were having a party with Twinkle's wand as the centerpiece. Hello, moonlight mice, Stardust greeted them with a friendly neigh. I believe you have something that belongs to my dear friend Twinkle. The mischievous mice, startled by Stardust's sudden appearance, squeaked in surprise. However, Stardust's gentle eyes and soothing voice soon calmed them. We didn't mean any harm, one of the mice apologized. We just loved the sound the wand made, and we wanted to have a little party. Stardust smiled and said, I, I understand, little friends, but Twinkle is sad without her wand, and the Festival of Dreams is approaching. Can we please have it back so that we can make a special wish together? The moonlight mice, realizing their mistake, nodded and returned the wand to Stardust. Grateful and relieved, Stardust thanked them and promised to visit them again to share the joy of the festival of dreams. With the silver wand in her possession, Stardust returned to Twinkle, who was overjoyed to be reunited with her favorite magical instrument. Oh, Stardust! You're the best friend a little pixie could have, Twinkle exclaimed, her eyes sparkling with happiness. The two friends continued their journey back to Glitterville, where the Festival of Dreams was about to begin. As they approached the town square, the air was filled with the scent of sweet treats, and colorful lights adorned the trees. All the magical creatures of Glitterville gathered around the central fountain, where Stardust and Twinkle stood side by side. As the first star appeared in the evening sky, Stardust encouraged Twinkle to make her wish. Twinkle closed her eyes, waved her silver wand, and made a wish filled with hope and joy. Stardust's horn glowed brightly, and a shower of twinkling stars surrounded Twinkle, carrying her wish to the magical realms. The festival of dreams had begun, and one by one, each creature made their wishes with the help of Stardust's magical powers. The night was filled with laughter, music, and the shimmering glow of fulfilled dreams. When it was time for the grand finale, Stardust turned to Twinkle and asked, What is your deepest, most magical wish, un dear friend? Twinkle thought for a moment and then whispered, I wish for everlasting friendship, joy, and the magic of Glitterville to shine in the hearts of all who live here. As Twinkle's wish echoed through the enchanted land, 
A brilliant burst of light illuminated the night sky. The stars twinkled brighter than ever, and a wave of warmth and happiness spread across Glitterville. The magical wish had come true, bringing everlasting joy and friendship to all of the creatures in the enchanting land. And so Stardust the Unicorn, with her shimmering coat and magical powers, continued to spread joy and make wishes come true in Glitterville, ensuring that the magic of friendship and dreams would always shine brightly in the hearts of all who believed in the enchanting power of the Festival of Dreams. The end. Thank you for listening.